What's up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, you can smash this sub button to be notified for future readings. This is free general collective reading for all signs. Have to decide to everybody in between. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, apply. everyone has free, free will. Only take the messages that resonate with the rest. Free general collective reading. Thanks, everybody, for all the love and support to the channel. If you like to donate, it's High Priestess 205. The link's in the description box below. PayPal only. No cash, have no Venmo. It's a very private, confidential way to donate if you choose to donate. Um, thanks everybody for all the new subbies. I appreciate it so much. Love you guys. And, um, there was something else I was going to say. I had a brain fart. I forgot. <laughs> I forgot. Well, if I remember it, it's that important. I'll let you know. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh yeah. I remember. I remember. Brain fart. Relieved. Um, I put my information for personal readings in the description box now. I left it out for a while because I just made the video when they're open, when they're closed. So from now on, I think what I'm going to do is just keep the uh, information for the personal readings in the description box. And if you're interested, just text me. And that way, um, we'll just do it like that. Um, I think that'll work better for everybody because I know everybody's on different time and life paths. So, um, you know, you might... You might need a personal reading when, the, you know, I don't have them open. So, um, I just figured I'd just do it that way. So, um, if you are interested in personal reading, um, all the information for the personal readings is in the description box. If you're interested, just text me, um, and then we'll go from there. But you do not pay the $125 until we agree upon a scheduled time. Um, Okay, it's in the description box, and that's the way I'm going to keep it because I don't want anybody. Um, the reason whole one of the whole reasons is why I I opened them and closed them and opened them and closed them is because when I first posted the this um readings down there, uh, it's been a while, but when I did, um, people would pay me. Um, for the reading, I'd ha I'd refund them. I'd, well, I didn't have to refund them back the money, but I didn't feel right keeping the money and not doing the reading, so I'd have to refund them back the money. Um, it, it was back when I was working full time. I had my kids full time, and I just I didn't have time to do the reading at that time. But so what we're going to do is, if you want the reading, <laughs> you you wait until we schedule a time. When we schedule a time, then you can pay me the re, uh, pay me the money, but not until you can, preferably before the reading starts. That way, there's no question about money. Okay, um, I I didn't mind doing that because I knew I didn't have time to do the um to do it at that time. Being you know full time mom, have my kids full time, full time job, and and doing this on the side, but I just don't like people just paying me. For the reading and me not being able to do it. Now a donation is different. It, you can donate at any time, anytime, anytime, and I accept all donations anytime, anywhere. Um, I got several donations yesterday, and I appreciate the donations. But if you're gonna pay the hundred and twenty-five dollars, because that's how much reading is for, from me for twenty minutes, do not pay it until we schedule a scheduled time. Okay. Now, if you want to donate, you can donate anytime, okay? I just want to make sure that's clear, okay? All right, so I did receive a channel message in. I'm going to do it, just saying, just saying. So, and it's a beautiful one. It really is beautiful, you guys. So, um, we're going to do it. Don't forget the basics. Time is fluid. Energy is fluid. If it doesn't apply, it apply. Everyone has free will. Only take the messages that resonate with the rest. Free general collective reading. Love you guys. Okay, so. The channel message is, <laughs> love is in the air. That's what I heard. What the hell, man? I I never get those kind of channelings. Y'all know that. I get decapitated body parts washing up on shores. I get cold cases. I get um, black magic coven disbandments. I get um, hands, decapitated hands with a wedding band on it. Specifically in males. I mean, I don't ever get shit like that, but I did. I did. Heard love is in the air. That's all I heard. I was over here chilling my kitties, man. 
They were all snuggled up on me like a little baby. And I heard, now he moved because I'm getting out. I heard love is in the air. And that's just the damn truth. So love is in the air for somebody. I guess we're doing a love reading. Just saying, just saying. So I got my, my handy dandy deck out. Like Blue's Clues. And we're going to do it. Love is in the air, baby. Someone's been heavily researching somebody. Oh, Lord. Somebody's been heavily researching somebody. Love is in the air. I hope this isn't a stalker, obsessive, creepy kind of way. It is not. It is not. Okay. Thank God. It is not. Okay. Oh, man. Because I get stalkers up in here, too. We know that. <laughs> Love is in the air. Somebody's been researching somebody. So whoever you are, think somebody's got feelings for you. Um, feelings of love. Now, you know, I hopefully this is a mature kind of love. And they're not going to chop you up in 50, 50 million pieces and put you in somebody's trunk or their trunk. or. And then, you know, it's a 48 new special. Um, and I'm just serious. Um, but I heard it wasn't. It wasn't a stalker, obsessive, creeper kind of love. So that that's good to know. No, um, not you know, not psychopathic. Um, that that or sociopathic. That's always a good thing. Just saying, just saying. Love is in the air. Not in a stalker, obsessive, creepy kind of way. And somebody's been researching you. But I, I think they might be doing like a background check thing or. Um, if you're a professional out in the 3D workspace, maybe they're um, public record searching your professional credentials or public record searching you or researching your social media or something. Um, that's what I'm feeling, but you plug it in, how it resonates. Experiment message just you have reflected. We have beauty on the bottom of the deck. I think they think you're very um, handsome or beautiful, sir or ma'am. Just saying, just saying. Love is in the air. Spirit messages you have before, okay? I heard get energy too, so I'll get energy. I gotta go grocery shopping in a few minutes. <clears throat> I don't have to, but I want to. I want to go grocery shopping. I gotta get me some stuff and get my kitty some stuff. Okay. Spirit message is your okay. All right. So we have number forty two, twenty, forty. 11 and the beat from the random person down the street that's confirmation 42 20 40 11 and we have playfulness and success holy shit man and magic i'll take them all right so we have number 42 20 40 11 25, 34, 15. If any of those numbers resonate for anybody, that could be any kind of significant numbers in any shape, form, or fashion. 42, 20, 40, 11, 25, 34, 15. We have chaos, renewal, passage, power, magic, success, playfulness. Love is in the air. All right, let me just see if I hear anything. A very significant, significant connection between an investigator and a psychic investigator is about to become very significant. 
in a very positive way. A very significant connection between a psychic investigator and an investigator is about to become very uh, significant in a positive way. So you plug it in, how it resonates, some kind of very significant connection between uh, a psychic investigator and, invest and an investigator. Now, an investigator, that could be a PI, private eye, that could be a police investigator, that could be um, a Fed. However, that resonates, some kind of investigator, it could be state investigator. I mean, there's a freaking shit ton of investigators so whatever kind of investigator this is um between an investigator and a um psychic investigator so you know there's many psychic investigators many of us out there so how you know whoever this psychic investigator and this investigator is very significant positive connection um it hasn't happened yet it hasn't happened yet i heard it hasn't happened yet in the world 3d world in the world, in the 3D world, in the world, in the 3D world, so the everyday world we live in, the connection has not happened yet, but it sounds like it's about to, that, maybe that's love in the air, maybe there's going to be sparks formed there, um, possibly, um, I didn't hear that, but, you know, we got the love is in the air, love is in the air, channeling earlier, so, um, it might, it might form attraction, um, possibly, if both of these, well, maybe they were both these people are single, I don't know, um, but it's going to form some kind of sparks. Um, I'm feeling, I'm feeling with the love is in the air. Okay. Um, you plug it in, how it resonates. When this occurs, it's going to draw a lot of people of these people's past back. A lot of people. Not a good idea. When this occurs, it's going to draw a lot of people from both of these people's past back. That would not be a good idea. So you plug it in, how it resonates, investigator and psychic investigator. Sounds like you guys are about to meet in the 3D soon. Um, now, how the hell you meet, I don't know. But um, somehow, you're about to meet. And when it occurs, it sounds like there's going to be attraction there. Um, like, sparks. Just saying. Um, but when this occurs um now however you guys meet however you connect or what have you what have you somehow when you guys connect um and it sounds i heard in 3d so in the everyday world um it's going to draw people of your past back i'm feeling lovers of your past back lovers or people that wanted to date you back it's gonna it's gonna create jealousy between past partners is what i feel or past people that wanted to be with you. Both of you. I heard both of you. Not just one of you. Both of you. I heard it would not be a good idea. So you plug it in how it resonates. So I think the chaos will be if your people, your past come back, whether you were with them romantically or not, is what I feel. Um, there's a reason this investigator and this psychic investigator are about to connect in 3D. Now, why? I don't know why. Um, I haven't heard why. I'm ooh, I'm feeling it might be some kind of collaboration is what I feel. I think it might be some kind of collaboration. I didn't hear it was going to be. But I kind of feel it might be. But we, that's what I'm feeling. Let me see. Collaboration. Collabor okay, collaboration. I heard collaboration. Okay, so collaboration. Some kind of collaboration. I think some kind of work thing. I think it would be some kind of work thing. Some kind of collaboration. Heard collaboration. It might be just communicating about uh, something. Um, it might be a case. I'm thinking it might be a case. Um, collaboration. Now, that can be like getting paid or just communicating like one of you's getting paid or you're both getting paid i don't know the details of that but collaboration could be just communicating like cooperating or it could be like working together like you're both getting paid however that resonates but it's gonna form some kind of connection there uh, i'll tell you that and um it's 
however this resonates, it's going to form jealousy between people of your past. Investigator and psychic investigator. I'll tell you that. You can be masculine or feminine. Investigator or psychic investigator. But it's going to form jealousy. Extreme jealousy. It would not be a good idea. Extreme jealousy. It would not be a good idea. That's confirmation. Extreme jealousy. So I think that's the chaos. It's going to form jealousy. Um, whether you both are getting paid, one are getting paid, or what have you, what have you. It's going to, y'all working together in some kind of collaborative effort. Um, I think it's on the case or cases. It's going to form um, the chaos, the jealousy of people your past. I think it's lovers um, or just other people. I heard it wouldn't be a good idea to basically re-communicate with these people in the past. So if anybody needs to hear that. Renewal, um, that's the people your past want to come back causing chaos. Chaos, chaos of conflict energy. If you need to hear this, investigator or psychic investigator, if that resonates, okay? Um, passage. <clears throat> you both are about to be on the path to success in a huge way. You both are about to be uh, on the path to success in a huge way. So, okay. So, um, Passage. I feel this is like an initiation, rite of passage kind of energy. I didn't hear initiation or rite of passage. I just kind of intuitively feel this. But I heard you're about to be on the path to success in a huge way. I think initiation here, um, rite of passage is what I feel, which is going to bring success. And I did hear success in here. So you plug it in how it resonates. Power. I think it's going to bring you both power. Maybe one's a position of authority or you both are. Or a position of high authority of your own life. Hell, I don't know. Just saying, just saying. I'm position of authority of my own life. Just saying, just saying. But um, I feel uh, with the uh, investigator, I definitely think you're a position of authority. Now, the psychic investigator, I know we're, we're all different. So um, some of us, most of us have our own businesses. And that's just the damn truth. Um, now, private investigator, you're probably position of authority of your own life, too. I think you probably have own your own business, too um possibly unless you work contract out with somebody or you work for somebody but um i am feeling position of authority here energy here whether you own your own business or um or you are a position of high authority of your own life um or position of authority in a company or um or for a corporation or what have you what have you Very strong together. Very strong. Very strong together. Very strong. So you're very strong together. Um, this investigator and the psychic investigator, you're very strong together. So power in this aspect is power, um, power together, like um, strong together. Like it could possibly be power couple energy down the line, possibly. Um, I didn't hear that in this reading, but I, I intuitively feel that if you chose to make it that way. I mean, you know, everybody has choices in life, and that's just the truth. If you don't choose to make it that way, you don't choose to make it that way, and that's just the truth. But whether you do or don't, you're strong together, and there's going to be some kind of collaboration here. I'll tell you that. Um, it sounds like upcoming in the universe. So power of your own life, power of the situation, magic. Um, I didn't hear anything. I didn't hear anything, but I will tell you, I didn't hear anything, but I feel if this resonates uh, possibly for maybe one of you guys, I think you guys are about to collaborate on a case. I'm serious. Whether one's getting paid, both's getting paid, or what have you, what have you. Somebody, there's a reason you're about to meet. And it's about, I think it's about, it's about to be about a case. I think it's about a black magic case or black magic or magic that was used in the past and i'm not talking about the fun kitchen witch shit or the fun um garden witch shit i'm talking about like coven shit is what i'm feeling coven like black magic coven shit and i'm just being for real i hate to say that but i i was pulling in coven energy earlier
I didn't hear anything else. Spirit only gives what well, spirit only wants to give, but I'm telling you, I, I intuitively feel this is about black magic. Like a, something to do with a black magic coping case or something like that. And I'm just being for real. Success. I heard you're going to have success. Um, double deuces with the spiritual download and the card. Success. Playfulness. You both are going to be very, very, very good together. Very good together. In many ways. Oh, shit. I feel spicy vibes here, man. And I'm just being for real. Oh, my God. I heard you're both going to be very, very, very good together. Very good together. Um, Very good together. I mean, very good together. Just saying. Um, <laughs> Whoever you are and how this resonates, um, I think you're going to joke around and play around with each other. I mean, not in a, not in a funky way. I'm just saying, but. Well, maybe, <laughs> if you choose to make it that way. I'm not trying to be like that, but I'm just being for real. Like, I just think, like, you might have both have good personalities, um, and maybe you will bring the best out of each other, which will um, cause success. <laughs> I'm serious. <laughs> you plug it in, how it resonates, man. I'm serious. I do. I think you might um, end up bringing the best out of each other. Um, I think you might like to both joke around. Um, of course, appropriately, you know. Um, there's a time and place for everything, but I do. I think you might both be um, like to joke around or play around or um, or just, you know, I'm not talking about a manipulative um, false mask way. I'm just talking about like in a fun, jovial kind of way. Let me see if I hear anything. Both have really good personalities. Really good. Both social justice warriors. And both want the truth to come out. Both have good personalities. Both are social justice warriors. And both want the truth to come out. So both of you have good personalities. You're both social justice warriors. And you both want the truth to come out. So playfulness... Um, um, you both have good personalities, so you might joke around with each other, and I think um, with you having so much in common, well, both wanting the truth come out, both um, having good personalities, and it uh, sounds like you both are happy-go-lucky too, that it will create positive vibes there, um, and it might just be naturally that you end up playing around with each other, like joking around, um, just having good positive vibe space there is what I'm saying, like. That's what I feel. But you plug it in how it resonates. Um, that's my hunch on this. Um, and I think that's going to lead to success too because her collaboration. So I think y'all are going to work together uh, is what I feel. This hasn't happened yet, but I, I think you're going to work together, which is going to create the good personalities and all the social justice warrior and the one the truth come out, all the things you have in common there. Um, psychic investigator, investigator. It's going to cause success with the meshing of the personalities is what I'm feeling. But you plug it in how it resonates. Yeah, that's what I feel. All right, let me see if I hear anything else. <clears throat> All right, I didn't. All right, we're done. All right, love you guys so much. Several shocking series of chain events are going to occur with this soon. It's going to start speeding up quickly. Several shocking series of chain events are going to occur with this soon. It's going to start speeding up quickly. So several shocking series of chain events are going to occur with this. And it's going to make, it sounds like, things in the energetic space in the world speed up quickly. Um, you haven't met yet, investigator and psychic investigator. But it sounds like something in the universe is about to speed up. Which I think is going to make you two meet soon because you haven't met yet um 
That's exactly what I think. But you plug it in how it resonates, okay? Love you guys and namaste.